Three persons have been accused of robbing a taxi operator under the guise that they wanted to use his services. They have been charged by the Constant Spring Police in San Andrew. They are 23-year-old welder Anthony Davis, a construction worker in Nimoy, and 18-year-old Shanice Lynch, all from Denham Town in Kingston. They were charged on Friday with robbery with aggravation, possession of prohibited weapon, unauthorized possession of ammunition, and using a prohibited firearm to commit a scheduled offense. The incident happened along Cypress Drive in Red Hills in San Andrew on May 4th. The police alleged that close to 8.30 p.m., a man who operates a taxi received a pickup request from Miss Lynch. On arrival, Miss Lynch, along with Robinson and Davis, entered the vehicle and allegedly held and robbed the complainant of his belongings. The man was told to run and the three accused reportedly used the car to escape. A report was filed and the police quickly apprehended the attackers. The vehicle was searched and a .38 revolver containing six rounds was found. They were charged after a question and answer session in the presence of their attorney. A 29-year-old 29 29 man said to be of unsound mind is suspected to have drowned in the Rio Mino in Clarendon on Sunday, leaving his mother to cry on Mother's Day. The mother said that she is very saddened because it is Mother's Day, and unfortunately she is in receipt of a tragic Mother's Day gift. She was at the scene where her son, Demar Cole, was discovered. Cole's body was found near the Mapin Bridge. The Mapin police mentioned that residents alerted them to a body afloat in the river about 9 a.m. Cole was pronounced dead at the hospital. Jones disclosed that her son had been mentally sick since 2012. She said that it was not the norm for her son to visit the river. She also mentioned that her son would have celebrated his 30th birthday this month. Investigations are still ongoing. Thanks for watching and goodbye.